right. Round two is go. Round two is go. And, uh, yeah, we want to play first because oh. we don't have anything to drop nope. until turn three. Yep. Uh, that's not, or I, turn. That's not wish, bad. I wish we had blue, blue, blue but, um, yeah. and they're pretty but a strike, more, you but, know. Okay, we'll take a strike. Yeah. Yeah, core prowler doesn't suck either. Nope. We don't send that back, but no. we're not all <laughs> we are, together happy We are going to kick it to the curve. Right. Who is this that we're playing now? Um, Do we care? We didn't scout this guy, did we? No. We only scouted one person mostly because we were absorbed in our own conversation. Yeah. Not because we've we been didn't. having deep thoughts and we're fucking drunk. Laughing at our own jokes, mostly. <laughs> <laughs> Well, uh, well, I mean, if you're, yeah, if you really want to lay it out like that, yeah. then yeah, we're amusing ourselves. <laughs> you know, but rather than amusing the audience, we chose to amuse ourselves. I would say the basis of this show is amusing ourselves. And, yeah, pretty much. And just hoping. And any, anything that comes of it. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. More, more blue or more stuff. Yeah, I really, really, really appreciate it. Well, I'm, I mean, I'm... Blue, I mean islands. Ooh. Blue, red, interesting. So he's got the spin engines, probably. Yeah. Spin engine, I I like the spin engine. Oh, I love it. I love it. I mean, if you can get that er out early, that could be I really, built, really uh, I built a sim deck that had four... Uh, it was a uh, besieged Scar Scar. It, uh, it had three spin engines and four cool Dolpha replicas. So it was huge red, obviously, uh, but that was just some, I mean, that's great <laughs> removal for one thing, and then you make them unblockable. It was just, it was interesting. So he must have just drawn that, because yeah. otherwise he would have played it last turn. <laughs> so, um, so we're in a mirror match, we're not going to be able to do anything for a while. But I'm, I'm good with that, actually. It's a slow format. Right. It really is. Too bad we didn't get that last turn, but we have to put out the Shrike. Oh, yep. Yeah, absolutely. And he force him to burn it, because he will burn it. He probably will. Um, Strand Walker, we do actually have our only equipment yep. when we have our Priest, which is when you want it the most. So, do you feel like um, Burn the Impure? That's possible. Yeah, I, I mean, I didn't. I only. I don't think I saw one. Ooh. He might Ooh. also have that uh, blister stick shaman or whatever, where yeah, it yeah, just yeah. deals one. Uh, I really like the blister stick shaman. It's very good. It's very mostly good. effective against. Yep. Spirits. There you go. This guy. So he was thinking, well, either yeah, and we played right into his hands too. I mean, right. We did not block, and then he still. So he got his one point in. Congratulations, Lou Laskin. So, we have a bit of a decision here. Um, <clears throat> in that we can put out an infector. Well, we but can, it'll die right away. We could put out our strand walker. Um, which would be the most mana effective use. Okay. But it's not going to apply any pressure for poison. We could put out our Priest of Norn. Here. But... Okay, hold on. Uh, what does Core Prowler do again? It proliferates. It does not give them a poison counter. Therefore, uh -huh. therefore, I say we do the Strand Walker. Because okay. it is obviously the most mana intensive, but let's assume for a second that he does burn it or kill it or whatever, we should still, in theory, have the equipment, unless he, unless, unless, unless it's targeting the equipment the, or right. the artifact or whatever. Right. Okay, but we're still getting rid of that removal. The core prowler, we don't have any poison counters on him yet. We're not going to get through. Mm -hmm. Therefore, the proliferate is wasted. Yeah, I agree. So this way we can get the priest out there and uh, we'd at least be closer to attaching it to the strand walker, and mm -hmm. we might slow him down a little bit if he does not burn it. Yeah. Okay. That all made sense. <laughs> Even yeah. If it was a little long. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We should have recorded that for the verdict. <laughs> <laughs> and we 
you've slowed his attack now. Exactly. Exactly. Ooh. Um, so probably attack with the Strandwalker and try to get him to block with to everything. Block with everything. He'll just block with the mere sire though. Probably. He might block with the Oculus and the if he wants the card. Or he yeah, he's like, that's two damage, I don't care. So we can cast two Priest of Norn. Yes. Does he I would love to get another blue out there. Yeah. I mean, Graham won't have anything left to proliferate, but he's got. Yeah. Not a huge fan of that one. No. Yeah, I don't like that play either. Now, on the other hand, I do like having two priests of Norn on the table. I do not like the idea of discarding. When he chump blocks with that Drake, he has to discard one too, though. I know, but we He's have two. We have two very good cards. Well, we just have to get our head, get them out of our hand. Then <clears throat> I'm sure we're going to draw something crappy next. Yeah, that's very true. Another planes, perhaps. <laughs> um, here, do we want to equip the Strandwalker? Onto one of our priests of Norn, which would make it a three eight. Yeah. At least then he can block the flyer and just kill it outright. Right. In the process, we're losing a creature, and if he has, well, he's not playing black, so he doesn't have destroy creature. Right. He may have burn. Burn is not going to help you with an eight. What's going on? It's this. Yeah, we're just, it's just not active. Um, we got a second island. That's good. For our fuel for the cause. Okay, so put out the island. But I well, I was gonna say we don't put it out because oh. if we end up trading. Okay. Um, oh, I see. I see. Then is that what we would want to discard? Um, yeah, I'm fine with it because we obviously. No, uh, hold on. Is the core prowler worth more than equipping the strandwalker? Well, than being able to cast the counter spell. Uh, no, because the core prowler because the core prowler will proliferate <coughs> once. It will give him poison, but he'll just end up getting if it gets through. Yeah, and, that's what I'm saying. With the way this board is, it does not. The counter spell, however, slows him down and possibly prol proliferates. Okay, so. Am I strandwalkering onto a priest of Norn, or am I casting Core Prowler? You strandwalker onto priest yes. of Norn. That, that, okay, how, how much does it cost to put the strandwalker? Four. 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 How much does that leave us with? It will, two. Two could be three. Two could be three. So it's not enough to actually cast the. Right. But I think we have to do that because he it puts him in a uncomfortable situation of losing creatures. Right, where he has to chump, at least with something. He'll probably with he, the Oculus to draw a card. Right, and then with the Mirror Sire, and then with the Mirror Sire's token. I mean, and he can't really attack in. Right. Yeah. No, I'm fine with that. Well, he could attack with his flyer. I mean, we can't reach it. Skinwalker doesn't reach it, does it? Or does it? Skinwalker yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. reach. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so yeah. So, so we, so we shut saying. him down with a, with one infector. I mean, come on. Right. <clears throat> and and hope, and hope that he doesn't have an answer. Right. Um, do we attack with the other priest? Yes. Or Why don't we attack with both? They're vigilant. Yeah, absolutely. Because um, he could block with this and something else. Anyone else, kill, and it'll kill our guy. It, but still. But yeah, we need to get <clears throat> his blockers out of the right. way. Right. Even if we kill his Oculus and get a card out, we we take something. Off the board. Yeah. Which is exactly what happened. There we go. Yep. Would we rather reduce this to a two-one, or kill this? We reduce that to a two-one. I I agree with you. Because when we proliferate, yes. right, we would then kill it. Correct. And we're not at that point yet. No. And he may just 
and we don't have to jump with it. <laughs> so, right, right, and he might just jump with it. But he's not drawing the card. Yeah, you certainly attack him. Oh, well, okay. Does he not realize that we're going to... He wants us to... He wants us to discard. Do we let him do that? Uh, do we care about that island? Is that island with the possibility of proliferate or counterspell? Or, or, do, we, or do we chuck the, the core prowler? I say we let him through. It's two damage at this point. Yeah. It's not that big of a deal. Fair enough. And if we can proliferate, we can kill this guy anyway. True. <clears throat> you're very, you're very true. It just depends on what we draw. Right. Yeah, with any luck at all, we draw an island. Yeah. And, 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 and that would be the best of both worlds right at this point. Uh, However, that does suck. Yeah. Yeah. Mm hmm. Huh. Oh. Can we cast that? We can. Um, does Is there a two co counter cost counter spell? No, not in this. Not for that. Um, so, we would get a 6-6 six, six creature on the board after... But it's not in fact. Right. <laughs> but it's, we haven't done any in fact. Yeah, three hits. True. We would still have our strand walker thing. He would have his skin wing... Sitting there. I'm, I don't see why you wouldn't do it. Right. <laughs> do I attack first? Yes. No, because... Okay, well, how does it work? Right. I don't want to do it first. No. Because he would block and Correct. we would be getting one less. Correct. To discard. Uh, it, man. I would say the core prowler at this point. See, I think Oof. a creature is more. The thing is, is that if we can put out the land, then the next thing he tries to put out, we can counter, which means that our guy gets in again without being pro having problems. I, I guess I, I kind of see what you're saying. Like, right. Depending on what he casts next turn, assuming that it's not bigger than an 8-10, which this guy would be if we were able to equip it. Okay, yeah, you're right. Core Prowler it is. Now, we, now, did you put out the land our turn? I did not. So we need to play it then. Or no, it's his turn, isn't it? No, it's our turn. So then we need to put out yeah, the land. Yeah, we need island. to put out the land. Okay. And he's thinking, what? Oh, dirty. Good answer. Well, board's wiped. We need one critter out there. Sorry, guys. <laughs> That's actually not the worst card. Yeah. Yeah, but he'll be setting that thing. The problem is, is his his critter is a flyer. Right. But we'll have reach. Next turn, he'll still get in. Right. Oof. Okay, now if he's got one mountain back, which means he probably has crush. Possibly, yeah. Or he just, I mean, was tapped out and couldn't do it. So we equip. Yep. We have the amount of mana we need in order to cast a counter spell. Yep. Yeah, but at that point it's just a counter. See, at this point, we can't outrun him. Right, and he has three cards, and we have one. 
Yeah, but it's not good shape. Whatever his best card is, we have an answer to it. Do we counter that? I don't know how we not encounter it because yeah. he's going to hit us for six. Well, we do have reach, don't we? Right, but... But we can't another afford another fact that he could sacrifice to regenerate yeah. his guy. Yeah. Okay. Oh man. Can't attack. No. If we could somehow get him to put a skin wing on something else. If we had Divine Offering to destroy a skin wing, yeah. then our Virulent would, would kill. Um, and we definitely attack with that. Right. Equip the Strand Walker <clears throat> attack with it. That would put it at a Four five, and he said no because then it would right, right. still trade even with the right. Virulent. But we still, I think, have to attack with it. Yes. Kill his guy, and then we can attack with this guy all we want. Well, here, no, you tackle it. He blocks with the uh, with his little guy or whatever, and then you virulent strike him or virulent uh, wound. wound him. You know? Right. Yeah. Do we want to attack this turn, or are we keeping him back? We're keeping him back. We don't know what funky thing's gonna happen. Right. Yeah, I don't, I'm not convinced that we're gonna win this round. No. Well, he has two cards in hand and didn't do anything. A ton so of mana, yeah. He probably. Two land. Or the thing that sends two creatures back to our hand. The kind of unsummon effect. Mm -hmm. The Quicksilver Geyser. That would be the one. Hey, what do you know? <laughs> hey, what do you know? Sometimes I really wish I didn't know what they were going to yeah, do. Yeah, so you wish there was a little mystery. <clears throat> okay, so we lost this game. Yeah, probably. <laughs> okay, so blue green or blue red, not bad. We have not yet officially lost. True. Okay, the thing is, if we get a divine offering, we can hit the gargoyle, gain six life, gain a little time. Right. If he knows what he's doing, he would sacrifice the gargoyle yeah. before we gain the life. It, he would still lose his gargoyle, but... But we'd still lose to a 6-3 flying guy. Okay. Who's awesome if you have a bunch of dudes out. Right. But it's not great right now. So I think what we do is just time strike... And equip him with a strand walker. And, and we would have to block this right. guy. That guy gets through, we'd be down to one. Yeah. But we have another flyer. We have still have this that we could equip. So depending on what he did on his turn, he's a one card. Right. There you go. There's the answer. Yeah, good game. Wow, yeah, he's got a very tough deck. It's very tough. So, what's the spell that we would try to counter if next round? Look at his graveyard. What's the one you think would be? I don't know that we saw anything that's like really key for the deck. Well, maybe yeah. the skin wing. His what one? For him was that he was able to bounce our Phyrexian right, token yeah. back to us. Back to us. Right. 
and so that might be the card we need to go after is the bounce. Well, I mean, if it was a pretty circumstantial effect. True. <laughs> Love it. All right. Man, I am already getting a hangover from this freaking beer. What the <laughs> hell is that about? I know. Um, yeah. It's technically tomorrow. Is there anything we'd want to change about what we just did? Well, uh, on that last game, I had thought about Fuel for the Cause, put it in our third one. Right. And getting rid of one of our... Loxodons? Yeah. I'm still for that. I don't think the Loxodons are worth it, actually. Uh, I could even see taking one of another one out and putting in a horrifying revelation. Ooh. Or the Flinter might, but I know that's not going to happen. <laughs> what if we... What about Gus Skimmer? Just get another flyer there? We don't have any way to make it an effect. Right. But, but it could it could be a blocker for his flyers. Right. Or Oculus just as a card drawer. Mere Turbine as a perpetual wow. blocker for his non-flyers. I like either Mere Turbine or Horrifying Revelation. Knocking him down a card could be really annoying. I wish we got a pick. That's right. Well, sure. Maybe the Mirror Turbine. Yeah. Because instead of getting a 3-4 that doesn't do much for us, we just get a, C a, one, one a series of 1-1s one that... May also not do much for us. Right. But at least they could do nothing for us turn after turn. <laughs> oh, don't sideboard you won. Hit submit. Do. Sideboard out all of your cards and put in land. <laughs> 40 card land deck. Not without land's edge. <laughs> Remember that card, John? Uh, land's edge decks. I remember your lands and should I? I had one. It didn't work hardly at all. But when it did. Oh man, when it did, it was sweet. <laughs> oh, I win. It was just buying time. He had to pee. Probably. He's like, beating you is like a diuretic. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, yeah. We got that going for us. Beating you is like drinking seven cups of coffee. Oh, it keeps you awake? Nope, it's a major diuretic. Right. Yes, we're going to play first. Well, and that doesn't suck. We'll keep it. Because we know we don't have any two drops. Uh huh. Wah, wah, wah. <laughs> <laughs> We have a little while to draw a Priest of Norn. Yeah. All I know is a Flensermite with the, uh... The goddamn Flensermite! <laughs> with the what? With, with the, uh... Piece of equipment you just had out. Whatever it was called. The the Reach? Yeah. Mm. The Strider Harness or whatever it is, but it's not a Strider Harness. The... God, what the fuck is that thing called? You know what I'm talking about, John. I, well, uh, while I do know what you're talking about... Um, it's completely out of your head, too. Yeah. Well, at least I'm not the only one. But that on on a Flintstone right, so we would have been gaining life every time that we blocked with it? Yeah. I still am not sold on the Flintstone right. Drink more! Because <laughs> then I will be? Eventually No, I'm talking be. to George. <laughs> so he won't be? No, I just want him to be able. To, I just want him to start saying "flincher might." <laughs> it's a flincher might. God damn it! Just shut up about the flincher might. I don't know why you guys don't like it so much. It just, I don't. It's. Just, I mean, you guys did not question playing, uh, a blight mamba. Blight mamba can regenerate. I'm not denying that. 
But I'm just saying, I mean... Bly Mama's green, therefore it's cooler than Plunder Might. There's no green in this deck, Bob. You need to kill yourself. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Aliens to me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's why I need to kill myself. <laughs> One or more players failed to show up to this game. It's a <laughs> park for the courts. Nine minutes away from our timeout victory. Do do do. If Lou Laskin uh, is having marital troubles, or uh, or yep. perhaps has spilled a oh, <laughs> oh, our only hope. My theory was irritable bowel syndrome. <laughs> Another solid argument. Yeah. Let's hope he plays no land. That would be a good sign for us. Yeah. Hmm. He did have to mulligan. Well, that's good. I like it when they have to mulligan and we don't. Yeah. People are more likely to mulligan, though, when they're on the draw. I mean, what, you know. He probably didn't have to. <laughs> what? <laughs> he probably didn't have to I mulligan. Didn't, you know, I, didn't, you know, I, don't, I don't need to do this, but... But I'm on the draw. Put so, on the draw, so I may as well throw a card away. Because, you know, who the hell cares, right? Yeah, I mean, well, honestly, we are not at the skill level. I read articles about people who say, if you get this, this, and this, you mulligan. Yeah. I am not at the skill level yet, and I may never be, where I really am sure of that. Like, someone probably was saying, you didn't have a priest in order, and you had to mulligan. Yeah. Um, to me, I was like, well, I can eventually play those two creatures that I have in my hand. Because I have lots right. of land. <laughs> and I've had so many times where I have no land that I'm okay with not being good. But, <laughs> but you like play? what I'm doing, yeah. I'm okay with you not being good. Yeah. We all have to be because we have no one else. Nope. Come on, Priest of Norn. Right now. You're the one we want to see. Uh, hey, I'm liking how this is going. It might be as close to victory as we will ever get. Yeah, this guy's pissing me off. Yeah. He's playing like three different tournaments. He's probably playing in the, what do you call it, the 64 player. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> you are a dick! <laughs> like, just for that, I shall kill you. Right. Well, he's gonna beat us either way, so I might as well piss him off. <laughs> he says, I eat! <laughs> Okay. Now we got a divine offering. We hate you, Lasky. <laughs> we hate you. Actually, I have nothing but love. So Ooh. possibly, if he drops a land, uses one of his counters, he could be bringing out a forecasting cost artifact that I really want to destroy. Yeah. Let's make that happen. <laughs> It is. That is exactly what we want to get rid of. Yep. Wow. Huh. <laughs> you played right into our hands. I kind of like the way it's very predictable. <laughs> we know exactly what you're going to play. And now he won't be able to put wings on everything he has. And True. We not. should ask him how he thinks this game is going. <laughs> Will it be I eight? <laughs> Do you think Lulaskin? <laughs> Wait, haven't we played Lulaskin before? This name sounds really familiar to me. They, you know what? They all blur together after they, a while. They really do. No offense to our viewers. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly, you're all individuals. So. Oh, this guy. Important, shining. I'm gonna burn you! Fuck you! Lots of card drawing. Lots. Priests of Norn. Like that a lot more. Couple turns ago. Yep. Yep. <coughs> so is the play Core Prowler or Priest of Norn? Well, now that we actually uh, have a counter on the board, I think it's Core Prowler. What do you think, George? I would agree. Although, the priest, pretty sweet. Yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll get him out, I mean. But he may have to geyser us soon. 
That's gonna take a while, that's an expensive spell. Well, uh, Peace Strider we really don't care about because... Nope. We're actually hoping that he blocks our core prowler with the Peace Strider because we, then we still kill the Peace Strider right. because we proliferate yeah. and we give him a poison counter. Neat. I yeah. like this plan. Yeah. 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 That's a, something I didn't know about the core prowler before I played it the first time. Yeah. didn't really think about it, but yeah. It's He's actually, actually a three, three damage slide. Yeah. <laughs> right. And he pumps up all your other stuff like tree corns and stuff. I mean... Yeah, he's huge. Probably. Yeah, he went on our crap there. Thanks, Core Prowler. there. Titan Shrike. Oh, man. So he needs to, he needs to wipe the board. Yes, he so that he can draw a card and get rid of our Infectoids. Infectoids! <laughs> Worst cartoon ever. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know. I, I think there's something to be said for a uh, sort of Herculoids thing, but where uh, Phyrexia has come to yeah. the planet with the Herculoids. And, they, you know, and there's, there's the, the slag storm. Yep. Board wiper, just like you predicted. Yeah, wow. I am that good. But we've got the priest of Nord in our hand anyway. What do you have in your hand, sir? Slightly more than you do. Yeah, unfortunately, he has three cards. Which is too bad that we didn't play the priest of Norn, because that wouldn't have died to the slag storm. True. But who knew, right? Yeah. Hey, who knew? And with an infect deck, if you are not playing aggressively, you're probably playing it wrong. Mm hmm I agree. Now but if we can get our husk out there. Yeah. You know. Well there's there's so many things that if they just freaking come up. But it's the downside of having only what twelve creatures in the deck. I mean, yeah, it's a little it's a little slow for the creatureness. Jeez, uh, I hate this. He's got all those cards. He's just sitting on them. Will he put it back in our hand? He's got a geyser now. No, I think he has a creature. Mm. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> well, see what he does? Put out a time strike. <laughs> How many time strikes have we lost? That's two. Two. Uh, now we need some of those counter spells. <laughs> No counter this. Now he sends it back? End of our turn? Both creatures? Yeah. That would be my guess. Right, yep. right. Oh, look at that. So he must have a different answer for the time. It, yeah, he sent back no, his geyser, no. so he'll... Oh, well, oh, oh nice. nice. <laughs> but, and he'll recast his uh, wellspring and draw the card. Right. Wow, that, that was really well played. Well played, sir. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nicely done. I'd really prefer that if he had a few more things that would be coming at us, but... I wish we could get one of our counter spells. Yeah. Like, doesn't take much at this point. <clears throat> nope. Didn't we put an extra one in? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, so apparently, all at the bottom. Three of our 25 cards are... So uh, apparently the issue is that with two, they come up all the time. With three, you never see them. Apparently. Something better happen. Because this guy will eventually kill us. Really? He's, yeah, he's got a bomb and he's searching. 
I mean, he's he halfway has dead. Has enough he could cast a forecasting cast. Right. So he's got, you know, he's looking for one specific card to end it. So does it, was it a, do you think he's got the, uh, the red dragon? <laughs> well, that's a giant turd sitting on our hand for a while. Yeah. Pretty much, in fact, at this point, it's just a giant turd. What I like about it, because it is a giant turd, and technically that is also. At this moment, yeah. But we're at 23 life. Right. He's at 7 points. No, he has a ton of cards in hand. Yeah. And at some point, I feel like he's going to unleash some sort of... Unleash hell? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. He's so going to oh, him. He'll oh, cast no. the five. He's got the five casting cost burn spell. Apparently, he did. no. He just no? poked us with the purple. Oh. That's all. So he's new. He just wanted a jumper. Well, or you know, he just wanted something out. No, it's a jump blocker. Well, yes, Bob. It's a jump blocker. Don't so riled up. <laughs> Whoa, hold on, yeah. hold on. This, this, from, this from the man who, if I mention Don't. the Ith Fey element... <laughs> Attack again. See what he does. <laughs> He's not sure what to do. And our mirror turbine is not going to do a whole lot at this point. No. Although, it may hold off whatever right. starts coming our way. And if nothing else, we could get a whole bunch of them out there, and then when we Phyrexia <laughs> Rebirth... <laughs> yeah, it would actually mean something. Yeah. That's actually not a bad <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> kind of like that one, actually. The... Deciding what he wants to do to this guy? Is he's it? playing another game. <laughs> well, he's playing another game and he's like, God, how am I going to freaking win? Because clearly he doesn't have anything in his hand. Right. In spite of drawing all this crap. <laughs> or he just doesn't care. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's done with it. This whole game, I'm done with it. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> do not want. Yeah. So that means he's not going to be bouncing or at right. least with that spell. Yeah. Right. So next turn he kills our priest. If we attacked with it. Okay. Um, what I think we maybe do is just hold. Mm -hmm. And we can, if he attacks in, we can either kill that guy or wither that guy a bit. Hopefully he plays out some of his... Right. And then we can well, burn if, the field. If you put out your other Priest of Norn, um, and then, I mean, don't attack, but you put out your other Priest of Norn, you'll still have the mana to cast the choking fumes. We could do that, right, but, but if we're planning on is... burning the board... Right. And then we would be killing both of our priest and lords. Fair enough. And I'm really hoping to get like a like, three for right, two right. kind of. Or even more. Yeah. Uh, granted, it's not an effector, but it will still be the only hopeful critter, critter on the board. Mm -hmm. Which is good enough. I guess the thing which I like about what I was saying. Uh -huh. Is that if you get 
both of them out, you kill both, then his, you don't have to worry about his blister stick if he comes rolling in, because the choking fumes will kill him. It knocks the Pierce Strider down to uh, being a 2-2. Two, two. She doesn't take nearly as long to take care of. Okay. Um, so here do we burn the board? Yeah. Yes. Okay. We burn the board. He might board. have a counter spell. He might. Yep. Oh. He's returning his guys to his room. Just gonna get to the But he's used that spell. Yep. When he cast his blister stick again, it will not kill either of these. No, he'll, so he'll do a point of damage to us. But then, then he'll pure sure will do another three to us. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That doesn't suck. No, that doesn't. Although we will lose our choking fumes to the discard unless we cast it when he attacks. Right. But I'm okay losing the discard if I'm attacking with a vector which he can't kill yeah. he has to block. Yeah, I like that. Right. Yeah. So probably the Sarah Waker, which makes him lose a card also. Sure. What do you have to discard? Blister thing. Jeez. You have like four of them. Well. Yeah, no, they're huge. If you if you draft specifically, you yep. can get some pretty good cards that are, well, just commons. So there's a lot of there's a lot of good commons in the set. A lot of bounce. So his whole strategy is to take a bounce. Hey, that's sweet. So his one card is not a counter spell. thing about that is if he doesn't play another creature right we can offer him it yep and get in for our lethal and of course he didn't play yeah. of course okay i mean it doesn't quite do it right but it's close yeah. so find out what he blocks with first nice <laughs> So now we're at the same point where if he doesn't play something, I can kill both of those guys sure. and get him the following turn. Oh, I'd much rather kill that. Yeah. Wait, wait. Oh. What? I was saying if we divine off, if we had. Barely wounded that first, would we have given him a point Yeah, but we can now kill his mirror. Ah! I'm dumb. Okay. Yeah, yes, we, it would have done that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But instead, we do this. He's forced to block with that right. guy. We have wiped his board. Yeah, we hold back the planes. <laughs> to make and if, think we we just, if we would just draw a freaking. Yeah! Nice! And we did have another priest coming, but not a lot. Nope. <laughs> oh my god! And there so were all those counter deep spells. Into the wow. Freaking counter spells. Yep. And way down here, I even forgot we even had a corrupted conscience. Yep. 
This guy's got some good cards, though, man. He does. This is a, a that tough was, matchup. That was yeah. a well, yeah, that is well a made solid deck. deck. Hmm. Nope. <laughs> don't even think it. I, I don't know. What? what I wasn't going to argue for the Flintzer, might believe it or not. No, I was thinking. He's think you're thinking the Revelations just to force him to discard and mill. <laughs> yeah. Perfect. Yeah, we do not want to mull. Well, we need one more land, but we have two priests of Norns. We have this guy who can yeah kill us things. We have that. Let's let's hope we don't get hosed. Yeah, basically. And if we can get a advantageous board state and sit there with our counter spell. Well, the divine offering helps. Oh yeah. yeah. Hey, hey, Love hey. it. I don't know that it could get much better. Well, we need a second aisle and that would make it perfect. Well, okay, fine. I'll grant you that one. Mirror Turban, too. So. I just love that he's got so much bounce, though. I, I yeah. love that. I, I just. You know, it's not something I don't think. It's not something I think I would really do, but. Well, John and I, when we were playing the. That first game, man. There were some of those where it's just like the bounce was just so against our uh, yeah. Thopter assembly. Oh sure, sure. Oh my god, that killed us. Yeah, so annoying. Yeah, it's now something simple like that. You know, it's just a very simple one-shot strategy. But at the same time, the thing I love about Pure Strider, it does nothing doesn't kill us. either of these guys. Nope. Wither himself down. Right. And he's pretty much got. He's pretty much got to block one. But he didn't. He doesn't have to. Well, I think he does. And now we have ample two prolifer proliferate fodder. Counter spells. Yeah. He, I mean, hell, I yeah, would even argue. For him at this I point. would argue that we that we save one of those to eliminate whatever balance he's got. You know what I mean? Oh wait, no, I take it back. Mm. He's thinking hard, long and hard. Mm. Man, for all his card draw, it doesn't seem to have done him all that much good. I don't know. Well, I mean, he's he's only maybe he has too many decisions. <laughs> Well, yeah, but I mean, he's only one card ahead of us. He's drawn two extra cards, but he's only one card ahead of us. Right. Okay. Okay. Do I divine offering his Pierce Strider at the end of our turn? However, opening up the possibility that he could cast the thing to send both of our guys back to our hands without the. You know counter what? Spell protection. Don't worry about it. Just keep the counter spell just protection. Keep the counter spell protection. Yeah. Right now, I think that our big enemies are the bounce, maybe the slag storm. Lightstorm isn't really. A, I mean, not, not kill right. that one now. But. Well, yeah, but but, the, but there's that, and then that gargoyle is is hell too. Uh, the skin, or the we call it the skin wrap. That you might want to stop. Right. Yeah, we'll lose a guy. Right. And we just made his pierce strider weaker too. Yeah. Yeah. What? Whoa, he wants that thing dead. Well, you know, I'm okay with that. Yeah, he just <laughs> used yeah. two burn spells. Fear in one creature. And he, maybe he thought that our proliferate wouldn't work. I, I don't know, maybe he thought that maybe it would. 
Yeah, I don't know what IRL, but whatever. He wanted it dead. He got it dead, and we still got what we wanted. No, I mean, I, I also prefer the object, the idea of uh, having that not happen, but. <laughs> <laughs> Feel like we're still in that control state where we could put out our shrike and be aggressive, or we could, or we keep our counter and wait for him to come up with an answer to what we're doing. Oof. I like that one. Just wait. Just hold out. I can't believe I'm saying it, but. Yeah. If we get a little bit more mana, we'll be able to put out the Vidalcan. Right. Um. But we can't. We can't use him the turn we put him out anyway. Oh, I know. I know. But once he's out, he's a. Yeah. He might bounce his own guy back into his hand. Well, that's okay, then we counter when he puts it back I know, out. but that that would be my strategy. Okay, it's put up or shut up time, dude. How's your other game going? Mm. Uh, Don't care. <laughs> yeah, that one will let you what? have. Why on earth did he even bother playing that? Maybe he needs like one black. Are you fucking with us? <laughs> <laughs> you should ask him that. I think he's just giving up on this game. <laughs> I don't even think he cares. I I just wonder what those four cards in his hand like. I those are all land. But I can't imagine that. But I think I he has to have one of his bounce spells, yeah. and he's waiting for us to cast a second some, something else. <laughs> but George's <laughs> strategy of <laughs> non-compliance is paying off. Okay, so what is this? Uh, do we? It mean, buys him around. Um, Luster stick. I don't think we. I think we let him have it. Yeah, that is not going to. No. In this. Shrikes. I mean, he's got two shamans on the board. Right. Can we... We can't do that and counter, though. Oh. Right. On the other hand, we can't do that. We can't no. do that and counter. We can't do anything. But what we can do is, if he attacks in, kill them with the... Right. But he, he won't. Right, because he's just using them for... What if we... Okay, he only has two cards. Yeah. One of them is going to be the thing that can send two things back into our hand. Right. We could put out the Anatomist and the Time Shrike this turn. His next turn, he has to use that before our turn. Or we just Or attack. we can counter it. Right. Well, if we attack, we're going to... He'll... We'll trade. Yeah. And he'll lose one and we'll lose our good guy. Right. When we put out the anatomist, then we're going to have something that can put minus one, minus one counters and kill those guys. Okay. Yeah. 
the worst that. comes worse, he balances his own Blister Shamans back so he can do more damage to our Shrike or whatever. Right. What I am guessing, I, I think he will be bouncing a couple of our guys. Yeah, yeah. And move in for four. Yeah. He's got two more of those Shamans in his hand at least. And here we go. Oh, so he's using one of the shamans to kill. And yeah, another one to draw. Yeah. That's good. I have to admit. Okay, well, so I have So here, we attack, <sighs> and if he double blocks, kill one of them? Yep. I don't see it working any other way. Huh. Okay, well, well okay. whatever he does, you we, just, we don't even give him the option. We cast our core prowler, we divine offering it, and we proliferate to win. Oh, we can, we can <laughs> do that. Nice. Sure, why not? <laughs> I mean, but just, you know, on basic <laughs> principle. <laughs> oh. oh! Oh, what just happened? Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> love it! Yes, top deck for the win. All right, wow. well, we are to the finals. We are. What's up? And we better stop recording. I owe this all to the booze. That and don't for the love of God. How do we turn it off? Sometimes it just doesn't give us that option. Don't navigate from the page. I think we do want to. We have to close.